بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم الحمد للہ رب العالمین وصلی اللہ وسلم علی نبی محمد وعلا آلہ وصحبہ وسلم اما بعد ایو الحبہ I don't think it is a mystery to any of us the importance of fasting. And the importance of fasting, extra fasts outside of the holy month of Ramadan. And especially Ayu al Habba during this time of Dhul Hijjah. That we are now in the holy month of Dhul Hijjah when people are performing the great pilgrimage, making the Hajj which is the fifth pillar of Islam. The pillar in which the Prophet ﷺ said, when asked about Islam, he said, وَحَجِّ bayt in istitata ilayhi sabil. He said, in performing the pilgrimage, if one is able to do so, meaning if one has the provisions. So that's not anything new to any of us, that we all should be aware of the five pillars of Islam. But ayyuh al-habba, I want to remind myself and remind my brothers and sisters about the importance of fasting and tatawa, tatawa fasting, meaning the extra fast, fasting which is not required of us. And tatawa, as a Islamic term, it refers to at-taqarrubu ilallah Ta'ala bima laysa bi fardin min ibadat that it is seeking to come closer to Allah from an action of worship which is not an obligation so when we fast on Mondays and Thursdays for example that that is tatawa if we pray extra that is tatawa you know, praying what we usually refer as to the sunnah prayers. So let's look at some of the benefits of fasting to Tawa. An Sahl radiallahu ta'ala anhu an a nabiya sallallahu alayhi wa sallama qal inna fil jannah baban yuqala lahu arrayan yudkhul minhu saimun yawm al qiyamah la yudkhul minhu ahadun ghayrihim fa yuqal ayna saimun فَيُقُومُونَ لَا يُدْخُلْ مِنْهُمْ أَحَدٌ غَيْرِهِمْ فَإِذَا دَخْلُوا أُغْلِقَ فَلَمْ يُدْخُلْ مِنْهُمْ أَحَدٌ مِنْهُ أَحَدٌ رواه بخاري ومسلم In this hadith that was narrated in Bukhari and Muslim, the hadith of Sahl, رضي الله تعالى عنه, that he said that the Messenger of Allah صلى الله عليه وسلم said that in Jannah there is a door which is referred to as Arrayan. That this door is the door in which the people who fast enter on the Day of Judgment. And no one else will enter in this door, meaning other than the people who fast. And then it will be said, where are those people who fast? Aina Sa'imun. Then they will stand up on the Day of Judgment. And no one will enter this door after them. So when they enter, it will be locked. And no one, and, and no one else will be able to enter. This is narrated in Bukhari and Muslim. In this hadith, Ayu al habba it teaches us the importance of fasting, uh, the extra fast. Because all of us should want and desire to be of those people on the Day of Judgment to enter Bab Rayyan, the door of Rayyan. And Ayu al Habba, we ask that Allah the Almighty accepts our good and forgives our evil and blesses us to gain benefit during this time of Dhul Hijjah. And may Allah Tabarak wa Ta'ala rectify our conditions and affairs and bless the Muslims everywhere and forgive us of our sins. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.